One Step Closer is building more affordable homes around the country. Yep, crews are currently working on building the first 3D printed home in Florida right here in Tallahassee. That's right. ABC 27's Micah Cho tells us how the full home is coming along and how this is the future of affordable housing. There's something pretty cool happening on Clay Street in the Griffin Heights neighborhood. This is the first uh, permitted uh, residential house in Florida built here in Tallahassee. Frederick Juanis with Printed Farms, who is providing the machinery for the 3D printed house, says this may be the future of residential and even commercial construction. The technology is getting better and better each week, each month. New, new, new improvements are coming. This machine, costing anywhere between $500 to $750,000, can lay down about two feet of wall per day. And pending appraisal, the first of its kind house in Sunshine State will cost about $175 to $200,000. A step in the right direction when it comes to building affordable homes around the country. It is certified affordable housing, so we will be reaching out with our nonprofits in the area that help families locate those homes. Kendra Light, who operates Precision Building and Renovating LLC with her husband James, says... They hope this method of building houses will be 25% cheaper, a goal they plan to meet within two years. A house this size takes about eight weeks to build versus a traditional house taking about four weeks for the frame to be constructed. We are extremely confident that with research and development that we'll get to that point. Onlookers like Nicole Everett saying they're excited to see more projects done like this in the future. I think it's great. Uh, you know, I have worked in the affordable housing arena for many years and the thought that this could potentially be an affordable housing solution is just fantastic. That was Micah Cho reporting. Now, Kendra Light tells ABC 27 this is one of three other 3D printed homes being built around the country.